Go to what's poppin'. We right back with another one now. Frank Bankroll Freddy here got hit up. I was waiting on all the details to come back out to see, you know, what was happening, what was going on with the situation or whatever. After he had got hit up, cause there ain't too many details out there. But I will tell y'all this. I haven't heard a lot of Bankroll Freddy music, couple songs here and there, right? Now, I'm going to tell you what's so crazy. Bankroll Freddy Instagram. Look like he don't need the rap, bro. <laughs> hey, I don't know what type of deal he signed with QC or what he was doing, bro. But the money, the cars, jewelry, look, it's there. And now, I'm going to tell you what's so crazy. Before this situation happened, like, I'm seeing... Bank roll Freddy pictures like for weeks and weeks and weeks. Like Instagram just showing me like now I don't even follow him on Instagram or nothing. And it's just it just kept coming up. It just kept coming up, kept coming up. So I went and looked and I'm like, man, who like who is this dude? Like just er like every single time just is the money, the jewelry, the cars, everything. And I'm like, why do I keep seeing this same dude? Now? And then, so this is what I mean. I have, I had heard of Bankroll Freddy or whatever like that, but I didn't even know that it was him. And then I'm the Instagram is just steady showing me this dude with pictures, and I'm like, who is this? So I go look. I finally click on one of the pictures on the name. I say, okay, I see it's Bankroll Freddy, dude. Name it. Like, name it, he, like, you name it, he doing it, he got it. Cars, he got the Hellcats, he got the Vets, he got the Lambo truck, he got, the, like, bro, like, it ain't nothing. And I guess his favorite color is, like, purple or something, but it's, like, it ain't nothing that he don't got, bro. Like, I feel like at some point, if I could buy all that, bro, I'm not rapping. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I'm not rapping for too much longer. <laughs> I'm not... I'm going to invest and sit back and just let my money make money. I ain't trying to uphold no image. I'm not trying to be super, the super street guy, super tough guy, super none of that. But Bankroll Freddy just seemed like a cool dude that just like to get money and have nice stuff. But, I mean, if you go to his Instagram, like, and he popping like he done went platinum like 10, 20 times already. Track Hawks, everything. I'm talking about like he got it all. So you know, I don't know. Like they, I guess they say it happened in his hometown, a Little Rock, or whatever. Bro, you gotta stay away from that. Like that's where all your haters gonna come from. Like okay, so like say you a dude that's popping now, people can go on the gram and see you. But say like okay, if you from Little Rock, right? If they hated you, if those dudes hated you before, oh, they want to kill you, man. They don't want to see you looking like that. They don't want to see you shining like that. They don't want to see you getting money like that. And he stayed, he stayed shined up. I'm talking about from the jewelry to the cars to whatever. Like, it ain't, I ain't seen too many people. And I'm talking about, and the reason why I'm saying it about him like that is because, I mean, He's he's doing it and he's not that known. Like he's not that big. He don't even have a million followers on Instagram. Like so that's what I mean. Like he ain't that known. He he not that big. Now I don't got a million followers on Instagram either. So y'all need to go follow my <laughs> y'all need to go follow my Instagram. But yeah, bankroll Freddie gonna have to start moving better, man. Cause um you know. I know when you hood is in you to know being be back in the hood and go see your people and stuff like that, but man. You can't do it because they it's like they just mad at they either just mad at you and or just hating on you for everything you got and for you know what I'm saying all the progress you have made and all the progress that you make and he already had got shot up before, so you just got to start moving better, but. They don't want to see you in them Hellcats. They don't want to. That's one thing about us that I think a lot of us 
don't realize it to where it's just like these things are nice to us and these are the things that we worked hard to get. But I think we forget that a lot of people don't want to see us with these things. And within the social media, then it's just like if you really out there, if you really on a move, if you're really doing music, if you're really saying to a major, it's like the people that don't really like you, they gonna have they always gonna have the advantage because the only thing they got time to think about is you. They don't got time to do nothing else. They ain't got no tour to go on. They ain't got no show to go to. They ain't got no label to respond to. They ain't got to go pick up no back ends. They ain't got to go get no bread. So because they ain't got nothing to do, what you think they going to do? Worry about what you doing all day, and the minute they decide they can get the drop on you, then they going to try to get the drop on you. You know, that's just how it works. You know, that's just what comes to territory. You feel me? So, man, rappers... Start moving better. Y'all know it's that time of the year, too. It's, it's getting hot. Dudes is moving. It, it, and it ain't, even, it ain't even got to be another rapper. It could be your average Joe Schmo. His girl, ju his girl just left him, but she, she used to always listen to your music, or she used to always like your pictures, or she used to always talk about you, and now he mad and jealous, want to do you something bad, want to wanna take you out. Want to kill you or something. Don't like you riding in that C8 because he can't get a C8. Don't want to see you riding in that Hellcat because he can't get a Hellcat. Don't want to see you riding in that Trackhawk because he can't get a Trackhawk. Don't want to see you wearing that jewelry because he can't get it. You know what I'm saying? And I think a lot of times this slip by a man because we be so certain and so used to moving a certain way. And we don't think about that. I feel like these days, it's more than anything, it's just the unknown. And like, especially if you're doing st shows and stuff nine times out of ten, somebody always know where you're going to be at, but you ain't even got your mind on them because you got too much other stuff to do. You too busy to even deal with them. But they ain't busy and don't got nothing to do, so they whole focus is worrying about you and trying to take you out the game and trying to get you up out of here so you can't provide from your family, so... You can't do what you got to do and take care of your people and all that. So, you know, to y'all rappers out there, man, just start moving better. It's the summer. It's going to be a lot of people out. It's a lot of weirdos. It's a lot of haters. It's going to be a lot of dudes, man. They can't get in these VIP sections. They going to be mad at their girls leaving them. You know, you got to you got to be aware of all that come with the territory. And I can tell, you know. Bankroll, he definitely from the street. Like, Bankroll, he definitely from the street. Like, and I think he know that, but it's just like, you know, when it's in you, we move that. But no, nah, we got to, once once you elevate, man, you got to move better. Um, Y'all get in the comment section and let me know what y'all think about, you know, Bankroll Freddy getting hit up in his chin, man. Like, what y'all think? Like. And I mean, I, don't, I, ain't tell, I don't think he gonna stop doing what he's doing on Instagram because I feel like they done catered all that to the new artists. Like, that's the norm. You got the flex. But I'm talking about but this this flexing on Instagram is on a whole nother level. It's on a whole nother level. Like, I wouldn't even try to keep up. I'm not going to spend. If I spend $100,000 on, on the car, I'm not going to spend another hundred k on the car because you just spending hundred k on the car. And you know what? Well, no, nah, I'm going to get into nah, I'm going I'm to make that a whole nother video. But I want to talk about how all, how much money all these rappers be spending. And, and a lot of they, a lot of they crews be looking like bums. Not QC though, because everybody in QC caked up. Not QC. So I don't want to get it confused. But I be seeing a whole lot of people like, okay, I got this car. I got this. I got that. Yeah, the crew be looking bummy like, man, get your mans a rolly or something. You got it like that. Get your mans a rolly. Like, what Like what y'all doing? They be having straight music videos going crazy on Instagram, flexing super hard, and the whole crew look like a bunch of bums. <laughs> but anyway, y'all get down in that comment section, man. Let me know what y'all think. Facebook up, but it's under construction. The Twitter popping. The gram popping. The YouTube popping. I'm popping. Y'all popping. You know? It's your boy Boot, I'm out.